roof. Oh! oh! I can hear it! I think they're on the roof. Oh, this is still on the top, right? How many people? One we are currently on a road trip across Thailand and we are really making an effort to visit some lesser known places in the country. That's why today we're going to take you around Lopburi, which is one of Thailand's oldest cities and also home to more than 10,000 macaque monkeys who share the city with the locals. Okay, you should leave everything here, your bags, your phone, nothing hanging loose around you. <laughs> sunglasses. Yeah, take your sunglasses away. So the temple that is over there is called Prang Sam Yat, and that's kind of where all the monkey craze happens. As some of you may know, I'm not a big fan of monkeys, so we're parked all the way here, and we'll slowly make our way over there, <laughs> unarmed. <laughs> the monkeys everywhere in this town, baby. The sign, monkeys. monkeys, stuffed monkeys for sale. Monkeys! She said there are three rival gangs. The thug ones are over there in what? that in that building. Okay, they, they the abandoned building there. Yeah. Oh, you can see them climbing over there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And the friendly gangs are here. Okay, the main at room. the ruins. Yeah. How about the third gang? The two of them together here. Linkini making boy, huh? Oh, they poured up bananas here. <laughs> so they're eating the beans? Yeah, monkeys they eat beans and vegetables. And they're friendly, so uh, just don't make any sudden movement. This one right beside you, you see it? <laughs> Hello. Do you want to eat it? ถุงเท่าไหร่ครับสิบห้าถุงหนึ่งร้อยบาทค่ะน้ำแดงหนูสาธุกว่าลูกเราเป็นคนไทยนะเดี๋ยวป้าเทให้ส่วนผมป้อ
some of the locals here and they do say that like there's two times a day I think like 10 o'clock and also one time in the afternoon that they come to feed the monkeys that's probably why they were all out in this area it's an hour drive he said to the viewpoint I didn't know you can communicate with monkeys I can uh, I know monkey language okay have what we have <laughs> you see a lot of the buildings here are closed because the monkey has taken over. Yeah, I think they not just take over the empty buildings, but they chew all of the wires. The signage. Yeah, because you can tell like a lot of the wires are, are chewed through. The shop that's still open around this area, they protect themselves against the monkeys by hanging big tiger in, oh. in the front. You see there's one there too? Yeah. Over there. Oh. And also fake guns. <laughs> just are to scare like, them away. Are they BB guns? Or do they actually have it stuff? It doesn't work, in there? it's just plastic. Oh. It's just to Good. show show the monkey. As I mentioned before, Lapuri is a very old city in Thailand. So Prang Sam Yat is only one of the ancient ruins in the city. We went to check out another one yesterday. We'll show you what we saw there. We are here at Wat. Prasi Watana Mahatai, which is a mouthful, but it is a very beautiful ancient ruin here in the center of Lopri. It is strategically right across from the train station. So if you are coming to Lopri from Bangkok, this is going to be the first thing that welcomes you to Lopri. So the temple here was built in the 12th century, making it over 800 years old. It is a very impressive structure. It's quite amazing. The ground itself is huge. I didn't know Lopoli has such a thing, you know. Like, I have so very little knowledge of Lopoli. Oh, look, this one missing a head. This is like uh, probably one of the ballrooms that they host foreign uh, visitors. Wow! Oh. That's so cool! Look at this, you notice a lot of the Buddha statue here? They are missing the upper body and the head. I think it's might have something to do with back then there used to be a problem where people stole buddha's head but why in the temple to to sell for decoration like oh, a, like okay. a wealthy people would buy them and decorate their houses it could be i'm not sure but i think oh well, maybe that's, that's a good guess mm -hmm. look no head no head no head over there too safely back in the car and Note was telling me that he remembers there's a special festival that happens in Lopuri every year. It is called the Monkey Buffet Festival. It happens like the last Sunday of November and it's where they just put a whole buffet of food at the Prang Sam Yat temple and the monkeys just like go at it. I think that's why that's one of the main reasons a lot of monkeys are stationary at that temple because they're looking forward to the treat every year. So if you get a chance to go to Bangkok around November, then maybe hop on a train or rent a car and make your way up to Lopuri, which is only two hours away and see the Monkey Buffet Festival. Ghost. We 
stand on the opposite shore. Wow. Hello. Wow, we're so high up. Wow. wow. That's a pretty sweet spot. Look at those guys over there. You got the best spot. There are no monkeys up here. We are about an hour away from the city center. There's only dogs here. Right? <laughs> I didn't realize we drove up this high up. Wow. Okay, Lopuri is super flat. <laughs> like oh. the, the center of it is super flat. Okay, it's, uh, it's starting to rain a little bit. Let's go over there and get some snacks. And Coffee. some hot drinks. Yeah. Hey, you want to come? Come, with come, 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 come. Oh, it's a cafe brown. It's a cafe brown, right? And there's a traditional Thai coffee and Thai tea. What would you like? Thai tea, okay. Brown. Brown. Let's warm it up. Let's warm it up. Okay. It's warm. It's not too hot. Here, sit down. Oh, okay. Oh, we can sit inside. Yeah. Nice. What's next? Oh, these ones. This one melts in your mouth. Yeah, let's try these ones. I remember having this one as a kid. What is what this is made of? Just sugar? I'm not sure. Probably sugar. icing sugar if it melts yeah. in your mouth. Mm -hmm. What's the flavor of the popcorn? Oh, sweet. Oh, sweet. Oh, sweet. Oh, he made it from Lopuli. Ah, okay. You see on the way when we drove here, there's lots of uh, corn. Uh, feel. Good coffee. Perfect. Not really good, right? Yes. Oh, nice view for it inside. Inside the temple grounds. Yes. Remember the name of the place? Khao Praya Den Tong. Khao Praya Den Tong. Khao Praya Den Tong. Yeah. And since we're here, we might as well check out the temple, which is Wat Praya Den Tong. <laughs> <laughs> Just have to add the Wat in there. So this temple and viewpoint was very easy to get to. We just drove for an hour up and all of it is paved roads. You don't even need to hike anywhere to get up here, which is amazing for lazy people like us today. Oh, over there you see the iconic railway of Lopuli. Yeah, it's a very long stretch of the railway, which during the wet season, the mm. rainy season, when the water kind of fills up the reservoir it becomes like a floating railway because you cannot see the grassland underneath it right now it's kind of like half hidden you can see a little bit but after this I think we should go down to check out what it looks like I think you can actually walk on the railway too which is cool I think you might be able to see, to see uh, wild goats because I saw some photos on Facebook people taking pictures with goats but where did the goats come from? That's insane! Even though it's not like a big statue, but the location of it makes it so grand. And it even has like a real piece of yellow cloth on it. Wow! He's looking over the people of Lopuri. It's worth coming to Lopuri to see this. It's not like a huge Buddha, but... So we just parked down there and walked up to the railway. This is called the Kok Salong Railway. It's super beautiful around here and we can see some people camping on the grassland just over on that side. 
Wouldn't it be nice to have like a jeep with a tent on top? Yeah. So we can come and tent like that. That would be ideal. Babe, I don't think they're goats. I think they are cows. Like hundreds of them. Wow. And they're all different colors. Yeah, oh. so beautiful. I've never seen something like this before. Not this many cows. But they're herding them with the, the motorbike? Yeah, taking them home. Wow, wow. I love countryside <laughs> Thailand. That's pretty incredible. <laughs> Are you glad we stopped in Lapuri? Yeah. I love small town like this. It has its own charm. Although there's not a lot to do. But mm -hmm. if you're into nature yeah. and exploring the countryside of Thailand, Lopuri is a perfect place. And also if you're interested in history, then Lopuri also has a lot of ancient ruins for you to visit. And if you like monkeys, then this is also the place for you. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> We hope you enjoyed our day in Lapuri and that maybe one day you will visit this beautiful province as well. Thank you so much for watching and as always, have a wonderful day. We'll see, see you in the, the next, next one. Bye-bye. <laughs>